Cristina Gomez, uh, our number one seed and world number 72. You're coming out of a, a free love win against uh, Georgina Adelaide in your quarterfinal. How did you feel on court tonight? Uh, I'm feeling very happy with the results today. It was a free love, but it was very tough. Uh, she's a very, very um, tough player because she's a, she has a, a good physically and mentally. I think she's very, very uh, strong. And I remember the last time, I think it was in 2019, uh, she beat me 3 1, and it was uh, another tough battle. And uh, tomorrow, you're, you'll be playing Lily Taylor in your semi final. Any thoughts on that match? I think it's going to be uh, tough again. I played her some time, a few, few times uh, ago, and I, I think I played her two times and I lost. Uh, so I think it's my revenge again, and I hope to do my, my best tomorrow. We're all going to be looking forward to that match. And uh, with the COVID-19 restrictions keeping you either at the hotel or the squash club, are you still enjoying your time here in Odense? Yeah, for sure. It's funny to, to get on a scooter or a, or a cycle to, to uh, go to the, to the club. And I think it's easy. Uh, th this event is, is very easy with the COVID rules. Uh, and I think uh, this is the, the way to, to make a good tournament. And what does it mean to you that if you win the final on Saturday, you qualify for the World Championships? Oh, wow, that uh, is amazing. Now, if, if I win the, the tourna tournament, hopefully, uh, I hope to, to win, but it, it means uh, to me um, a very important thing to play for, for the first time a, a World Championship. So hope to do my best tomorrow. Okay, thank you, Christina, and good luck tomorrow. Thank you very much.